Oh, sugar. Come on, then. Yeah, you'll run now, won't you, you little bugger? Come here. Welcome back. My name is Charisma. Sorry, I was just watching that deal. Okay, I know I've been gone uh, a long time. And uh, I'm just going to give you a, a sort of like a blanket explanation for it. Um, I lost I lost my mum. And I, I really took it badly. I, I didn't deal with it very well. I ended up in a really, really dark place. And uh, yes, soon after losing my mum... Um, my, my dad got sick as well, so it was several things all at once. And uh, I had to take a step back uh, because I really wasn't in a, in a good headspace at all. Uh, now, I know I've, I've been gone quite a while and I missed A17. I didn't enjoy A17 anyway, uh, but yeah i missed i missed the whole of a17 i absolutely love a18 i i like the changes that they brought in and uh all that so there is that i would like to also say thank you very much to all the people that um, have supported me and continue to stay subscribed to the actual channel as well i mean it really spurred me on to come back anyway uh did that so that's another thing i want to actually say um, I am in a better headspace now. I am sort of uh, dealing with things that are a lot better now. So uh, hopefully you will welcome me back, and uh, we can continue with uh, with the channel because uh, I really did enjoy and still do enjoy gaming and uh, doing the videos for you guys. Um, also, thank you very much to all the people that did message me and uh, supported me through uh, the whole thing. Uh, it was really, really appreciated and uh, I don't think I could have gone through it without you. So, thank you. Okay, right, so what are we going to do for A17? Um, we're going to build and we're going to try and survive. And it's going to be awesome. I'm just trying to have a look on either side of this road uh, just because I do want to start building as soon as possible before we actually oops, go start doing trader quests because that's something we are going to do now I don't normally go and visit the traders the traders uh, were never really um, a big part of my gameplay uh, but we're going to do that this time going to. I know I'm collecting all the cotton up, but I just want to make some bandages. I know I can't make the... Hello, Pussycat. I know I can't make... Sorry, my cat's just jumped on the uh, computer table. I can't make the uh, medicated bandages just yet. That is actually a perk, but uh, I can make the normal bandages, which you know, are okay. So, I want to stay around this area, the starting area, and sort of branch out from there. So that's what I'm going to be doing. Okay, let's pick up some more stones. And because uh, it's pretty flat, it's pretty flat. And we have a desert biome that's just by the side of us here, if you have a look over there. And I want to be able to build um, my base because that's what we're doing. We're not going to use prefabs at all. Uh, we're going to go down the traditional route of, of the base, which normally I, I build the base and build the horde base um, within it. it. It's both. It's both horde and base. So I know it's going to be quite risky um, with how the hordes are now, but that's all part of the gameplay. That's all part of the fun. So that's what we're going to be doing. Building our own base and... Uh, no horde base, no separate horde base uh, or anything. So that's what we're going to do. And like I say, um, I want to sort of build, which, I mean, this is ideal because this is pretty flat. So I'm going to build here, but when I do the mine, 
which I do normally mine down underneath the base. I want to aim towards the desert because the only place you can get shale is desert so I want to be pretty close uh, with the forest and the desert so I can just have one sort of big main mine. So that's what we're going to be doing as well. Let me just see how many grass I've got. 47. Uh, not grass, sorry. Um, cotton. Silly. Silly me. I'm going to try to go through it pretty quickly as well. I don't want to be waiting, you know, a week and a half for the first haul. I don't, I don't want to sort of um, be doing that. I want to be able to get to the first board uh, pretty quickly and, and get the base, or at least some of the base, up and running. So that's the thing. That's the thing. I know, I'm just randomly collecting stuff. I would just like some more. Cotton, please. And I'm collecting the chrysanthemums and I'm collecting some golden and up, but that's just so I can put it away in the... Uh, box once I do that. I would like to get that deer but there's no chance I'm going to get that just yet. Right okay. I don't want to loot a great deal at the moment. I'm just trying to get the uh, quest things done. I would like some cotton please. Some more cotton. Yeah this is a really really nice flat area. Oh, there's another town over there as well. That's good. Okay. Okay. Right, enough messing. Oh, it's more cotton. There we go. Another bird's nest as well. Which is always good. Now, I do lose everything on death. So, I actually lose everything. I don't keep the tool well. I lose everything. Uh, the... Settings are default by the airdrops, which are every three days. No, I think that might be default. I'm not sure. Uh, the respawn timer is on 10 days, which I'm going to change to 30. Uh, I don't want to make it too easy for myself. I, I, want, I want to be able to uh, really give myself a, a hardish playthrough, which, you know... Eh, it's okay. It'll be fine. I don't know what's around here. Because obviously I've just stayed around this little tiny little bit here. Is that one that I've... Yeah, I've emptied that one. Not that one, though. There we go. There's another one over here. That's... Oh, I've done that one. Obsessed with bird's nest. Here we go again, like normal. Oh, it's church there. That's good. And there's football stadium as well. I've never actually seen one of the football stadiums uh, before in any of the other playthroughs. I have seen it in a, a single player. Okay, so we've got a few bits. Well, that'll do. We do need some food, but I would like to get that deer, but I don't think that's going to be a thing. Unless I'm really lucky and I find something awesome in a bin or something maybe but let's just stop that a second because ha I'm having to craft a lot so let's see okay I want to try and stay pretty close to where I started it's so much easier um, you know putting everything down and then I can use that with building from the, the get go So stone axe. I'm just going to keep doing that when I need to do things, do other things, sorry, should I say. I'm doing the bloody shirt. Let's just do this. Goodness sake, it's crazy. One thing after another. Wear plant fiber clothing. Done that. 
weapon, we could bow, craft, bow and arrow, we could turn up those. We're going to need to get some more. We've got another 34 here. Right, okay. That. There we go. Okay. Okay. Let me place the block. Right, come on. And I'm not talking very much at the minute. <laughs> oh, I was waiting for that to come up and it's like, well, it's not going to because I've just used all my stones. Silly, silly me. I'll just grab these while we're here. Yeah, I think that uh, I'm just going to build here. This, this is going to be my start. This, not start area as such, but this is going to be where my base is. This is I'm not going to move on, not going to find anything different. We'll just travel to the other places. And do quests and things there. It's like, she says now. You know, I might change my mind going through. But that's fine as well. Right, come on. I might even change my mind about the actual setup of the base, but again, that's just something we'll, we'll do as we go through. See what works, see what doesn't work, and we'll just change it up when necessary. And there we go. So, how are you guys uh, enjoying A18? Is it what you expected? Is it what you like? What would you change if you could? Ah, something. A few things I'd change. I mean, which I'll oh, obviously, you know, we can discuss as we go through. But yeah, there's a few things I would change. But there's a lot of things that I do like that they've brought back. You know, the, the making of the guns and things like that is one of them. Um, not like before, like when they first did it. But I still like it. I still really, really enjoy it. Okay, come on. Right, we need to get the... Oh, the trailer's not too far. Let's have a look. Oh, not that far, actually. So, we'll go that way. Just repair this. I uh, will leave a box. In fact, recipes, bandage. We'll do five of those. We might as well make those now. We'll put a box down here, because this is going to be our uh, little area. Right, there we go. I want to leave stuff here. I don't want to be taking it with me because I'll end up looting and... I don't want to take the chilli with me. I'm not going to take the bandage. Leave the lead duct tape we don't need. And think that. Egg. Torch. Take the water. And that should be okay. Let's see how many of these we get. We've got enough for one, that's good. So recipe, bone knife, I'll grab that as well. I'm going to keep hold of that because I probably will grab more. Okay, let's go to the trader. See which trader it is. See if it's rude, man. Oh, he's terrible, him. Absolutely terrible. Trade a wrecked. So rude. So, so rude. Maybe if I see something on the way and I think, oh, we'll, we'll build here instead. But I do really want. Oh, wow. Hello, Zom Zom. Yeah, I think that might be a good area because the big town there as well. Right, I want to watch out for uh, animals. I don't want to get killed straight off. 
I might go into the desert area and see if I can find some snakes and things just to get some meat together. Bunny rabbits. Chickens. Oh, hello, lady. Hello, lady. Right, I'm not coming near you, actually. You can leave me alone. Left me alone. I'm not going to grab anything else in that way. Like flowers and things. We can grab those at a later date. Don't need to do it right there. We do need to find a pot, though. Pot, definitely. The trader shouldn't be too far. Doesn't look too far. I'll find over this uh, mountain side, really, I think, maybe. Oh, hi, Steve. How are you doing? You just carry on. Just carry on. Lie in there. Yeah, one thing I want to get done, actually, is try to get uh, a mine straight away. That was absolutely rubbish. A can in a bag, that's it. Awesome. I'll probably get the surface uh, nodes as well, but... Not right now. I don't want to be uh, overloading on stuff as it is right now. Go up and over. We'll go back to the base, sort of where I just put the bed and everything. I think we will probably build there. That's going to be where we uh, where we start building. Hi. Hello. Oh, is he going? You need to just go away. Well, no time for you. No time. Um, who is it? Yes, it's wrecked. Horrible, horrible person. Horrible man. Let's loot before we go in to get insulted. Ooh, what was that? Like? Steel arrowheads. Nice. None of them lootable. Wow. Pot. I like to find pot early, but it's not lootable, so never mind. Never mind. Wow. Really not wanting to give me a lot, is it? The game. Nope. Oh well, never mind. Yeah, I'm gonna try to. I've been there. Can't see him just yet. I really want yeah, to. What do you want? Try to get through. It uh, was that the cat, man. What are you doing? Sorry about that. The cat just whacks me on the back of the leg. Under the chair. Freaked me out a little. All I felt was this furry paw. I thought it was but despite or something. <laughs> I know, really sad, but never mind. Uh, I'm going to sell a few things just so I can get a bit of coinage together. Not bothered about this at the moment. And, well, so, so we'll keep the rest because we probably need it. I want to keep the oil shale. Okay. I'm going to be buying things like this as well. You know, the bullet tips and things like that that I need. You know. It's going to be... going to be what I'm doing. Okay. No refunds. Deal's done. Now okay. beat it, fucker. So rude. So rude, mister. How far did we travel? Oh, not that bad. It's not too bad. 
at all. But I like this, how flat all that is. It's good. Right, okay, let's get back. Let's get back. Now, we will be doing the quests and things. First of all, well, I've just checked my area. Wrecked. Trailer wrecked. There we go. Make sure that we mark them on the map. It's something that I do forget to do, actually. I forget to do that from time to time, and it's, uh, it's annoying because I'm like, where is that bloody trader? Let's have a little scout what else is around here just before we go back. I'm still okay for bag space. It's always a good thing. It won't be long though, I will probably get myself over encumbered like normal. Because it's me. We do need to start looting though. We do need to start doing quests as well, but I do want to start to get items for the um, base. Rascal, you're actually distracting me, Puscat. He's just being lazy. He wants to see what I'm doing. He was playing my hand earlier while I was trying to uh, trying to move forward. He thought I was trying to play. I think that's a dog after me, I'm not sure. Can't see it, not a dogger. Coyote, but. Or a wolf. I heard it. No, there's nothing after me, that's fine. Good. Nice bodies of water here as well, so I'm not going to be too bad for. normal rock isn't it? Looks like it's got bird poop all over it. I've well, just totally lost my train of thought then. Yeah we're not going to do too bad for water I don't think. I think we should be okay. I think we should be okay. I'm just going to check this stump. I know you have to have the uh, perk for the uh, honey, but sometimes you do still get one. I think it's very, very rare, but you do still get one even when you don't have the perk. But I would like to get at least a jar of honey in my bag, just in case uh, I end up getting infected. need to get rid of it as soon as possible. I don't want to be uh, running around and... running out of time trying to find several antibiotics so then I can get rid of a infection. Because early game that's horrendous, it's, you know, death sentence, so. Okay, let's just get back and get these bags emptied and then we can have a little scout around before we start building, or start digging at least. I'm trying not to sort of waste too much time by just running around and not doing a great deal. I say I want to try to get as far forward as possible. Collecting all these little things up so I can make some frames so I can frame up the first bit. Right, we'll put these away. keep them. Okay, so we'll make some more stone arrows because we're going to have a little, little walk around, a little wander around. Because we definitely need a pot, so we're going to have to have a little, little look-see-loo around and see what we can find. I would like to start 
the base uh, but have a pot. I, I definitely want to have a pot before we uh, start digging and things like that. I do want to try to find some meat as well. At least I can do some grilled meat. I know it's not ideal but Right, I'm going to have a little go for the plants. I love these little gardens. Not great, but it's food, you know. I should really get rid of all of this and then when I run past I know I've got it. Otherwise I'll see the dead corn and be distracted for 30 seconds. Say 30 seconds, but it's probably more like 10 minutes because my brain just starts wandering. Where did we find a... Oh, so no, I don't want that one. I would like a scrapyard. Is there a scrapyard over there? Scrapyard would be quite good. Let's go and have a quick, quick look. Yes, hello, something. You just carry on fighting that. That's fine. It's not a lootable. Darn it. I would like to get some. Um, aloe as well. I know it's not, I can't use it to um, do the bandages yet, but I can do the cream and that can be used as is, so that's one of the reasons I do make sure that I grab that. Okay, I think the, that is the scrapyard over there. Nice shale there. Oh, little park area as well, that's cool. I think it's a scrapyard. Oh, brilliant. Yeah, it is. Well, let's have a quick wander in here. We should get a pot from here, because generally, on top of the shipping containers, there's normally one, and also, um, There's other normally here. There, it is. there we go. And there we have it. We have the pot. We don't have to go in now. I mean, we should do, really, to loot, but that's all I wanted to do was loot but come here chicken come here chicken oh, hi go away nope leave me alone I want to get some yucca now uh, now that I've got a pot um we can get some yucca. Let's see if we can find some snakes and things as well. That'll be a good idea. Don't know if you know, but if you get these, you get the uh, bones. So if you want to grab some of the glue, if you're in this area, you can grab those. Okay. Anyway. Anywho. Grab some of these and some yucca. If I can make some yucca juice, I know it needs the water, but I want to. Oops, why are you not hitting it? That's thank you. 
have a little wander around and loot what we can around here. Don't want to go too far, like I say, because I want to start building. And now we've got the pot. Awesome. Yeah, I either like <laughs> normally find one with the trader or the scrapyard. The scrapyard is normally my, my first sort of call. Or a pot. Because you do generally find one in the scrapyard. And if, you, like I say, if you don't find one in the oven, because there's normally an oven in there, stove in there. Uh, if you don't find one in there, there's normally one on top of the shipping containers. So, if you're having trouble finding one, you know, I'd, I suggest you, you go into there. And you don't have to actually go into the building either, you know, because uh, there's a lot of zombies normally in there. But if you just go around the outer bit of it, you can do it. It takes a while because you're creeping most of the time, but you can do it. Oh, sugar. Come on, then. Yeah, you'll run now, won't you, you little bugger? Come here. There we go. We need the meat, so... That was the only reason I chased that down. Then Normally I let them run away and then let them come back, so... Cause they normally sort of run away and then make their way back towards you. <clears throat> Don't help not having your bags really full though. <laughs> There's that. Hi Zom Zom. Yes, I hear you. Don't follow me though. I haven't killed a zombie yet, have I? No, I've killed a, a chicken and a coyote. say coyote. I don't know if that's right, is it? It's coyote. Uh. Okay, anyway. Anyway, before my brain goes off on a tangent all by itself. Because that's what I do. It's probably going to be a long video. So... Right, okay. Where's... I know it's a bit further away than I'm going to be building because I'm going to sort of build over in that direction there, but it's still pretty close for me to keep running back to. Okay, so we have a little bit. Where's the. Yuck, oh, there it is. It's only 12. Wow. That's not very good, but never mind. We really do need to get some jars and some more water I'm not going to bother with the lock picking just yet I'm going to try to loot a few places I don't want to have to run back to the trade just to get some Quests. No. No. Right, let's see how far. We haven't travelled that far actually. I'm going to see what's up this way. Keep going, see if we can actually find some jars. Maybe some more animals. Just a few bits and pieces. Maybe. I'll be cutting some bits out. Hopefully. She says, but I'll probably think, no, oh, that's quite good. Sprinting already. I'm really going to end up suffering with the food situation and things like that. So, if I keep sprinting everywhere. But I can't help it. I just like to get things 
done quickly. <laughs> oh, bag. Duffel bag. That's rubbish. I will get the little uh, trunks. Just like I say, sometimes you do get honey, but we'll see. Yep, there we go, there's a the honey. At least we've got a honey now if uh, we end up getting infected. Should be able to get rid of it quite easily, uh, as long as I do it quick enough. It should heal it. Oh. Okay. Little zom zom. I think I'm going to kill you. You could be my first zombie victim. Oh, got her. She'd be dead. Oh, bugger. Yeah, I don't want to go near that bloody thing. I really don't want to end up dying to something silly like the wolf, like walking into it and... end up dying over something so silly. Okay, right. Should we just keep going down this road and see what there is? Just to loot a little bit? Okay. Full feathers. That was really interesting. Why would people put full feathers in the car? Hello. Get down. Right, okay, I'm just going to keep running. I just loot a few things while I'm. that looking at some of the buildings okay I know I'm just grabbing little things up but I don't know that's all I need I don't want to uh, go too far and I don't want to waste too much time. Okay. Oh, come on, give me something bloody decent. Please. That water tower there. I'm pretty far away from the trader here, though. I don't want to be too far away from the trader. I have to be sort of travelling all that way with my bags full, especially with no vehicle just yet. If there were another trader closer up this way, then it would be alright. Hello, nurse and nurse and nurse and nurse. Right, and I'm just the meat and things up, that's something I want to make sure that I get. Right, okay. Food is just horrendous. So, okay. Let's see. Another no. That's my side. We need glass. We need jars. I'm gonna end up being over encumbered soon. You can guarantee it. I've travel, tra travel, traveled quite a distance. <laughs> Can't even speak. Use your words. Find your words. Oh, come on. 
absolutely rubbish. If it was rubbish that I looted anyway. Okay. Oh, come on, surely we just be another trader somewhere. I think the best place where we're gonna talk start is is where I am at the moment. I think that's maybe where we need to be. I know I'm collecting a load of rubbish up at the moment, but I want to find another trader or something. Well, we haven't found any jars. Okay, well, we best head back. Let's start building then. Uh, start sort of uh, digging out. Where I want to build. We're going to have to go back and get some resources now. Because it is getting pretty late. I do want to at least have uh, the framework down so to speak and then can work from it from there we will find another trader and we will start doing some quests in the next little bit don't want to have to fight with zombies right at a particular moment in time with me being eight over eight over have to go into a couple of houses I think and maybe find some jars from there I can feel them up going down towards the trader and things then. I want to try and grab some eggs as well because you can do some boiled eggs up. I know it's not the best use. I did. Not the best use of the eggs, but not the worst either. At least it's food. Until I get a farm up and running. I'm going to have to sort of try and eat whatever I can eat and hope for the best, you know. Okay. Right, I'm going to get back to where my base bit is and then uh, see where to go from there. I'll avoid that wall, but I hope it's across the road. Okay, so I've been oops, busy. I've been uh, collecting a, a lot. I say a lot of stones. I've been collecting some wood up, and I've been clearing some trees around this way. Now I want to start building where that that bit is there, because uh, I don't want it too close to the road, but I don't want it too far away from the road. So, and I don't want it too close to the buildings. Uh, it does go down slightly there, but that's not going to matter that much, I don't think. We're just going to have to deal with that as we go along. Now, I've got a few trees to cut down here as well, but I'm going to start by building from this. This is going to be the centre point. So, one, two, five, six, seven. I'm going to have it seven by seven. I don't know whether or not it's still going to be too close to those buildings, but we're just going to have to deal with it. Might still be too close to those buildings. Yeah, I need a, quite a large area. Hmm. So... One, two, three. Right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, that might be okay, actually. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, that's uh, that's not too bad, actually. Okay. So it's going to be a 7 by 7 but I'm going to do 4 equal 
sort of squares and that's going to be where the basement goes. So first of all, I'm going to build these. Like so. So these two. I'm going to just uh, drop that. I'm only going to build one of these up for now. Only one of them. Just so I can put to the uh, God, the what do you call it? The bloody Oh Bedroll. Wow. Oh, why that took me so long to think of the bloody name for that. Weird. Come on. You know you can come on there. This is going to just be for now while we build through. Cause we want to build through and dig through the night as well. So that's a that's a thing. I'm just going to Oops, come on. Come on, drop the bloody block, will you? Build up five, I think. Even counting down how many we've got. So that's three, four. We will be changing it up some as well. So, quite a lot actually. So, I'm going to leave it for wood for the time being. I don't know if I want it. One, two, three, four. I think it's going to be five. I think five is a a good number. Why not? Come on. I am going to build a, a doorway in for now, just while. I uh, get the whole thing done. Come on. Thank you. Yeah, so then that's going to come across like so. is that way so we'll do that as the doorway for now I know I need to upgrade as well so but that's fine but it's fine I will be digging through the night so I won't be recording that low and then I'll just bring you back in the morning and and show you what I've been doing so that is basically what I'm going to be doing so this there's going to be four of these but it's going to match at the bottom as well so <laughs> underneath that where the basement's going to be so we're going to do the I think we're going to go that way yeah we're going to go that way another couple of these so and that's the middle there we go I'm going to put that there just so I can Make sure that I do it properly. I'm going to do the corners. If it wants to let me. And we can upgrade to cobblestone once I've started doing some cobblestone. So we can upgrade to cobblestone from here. If I do the corners, I can upgrade through the night, sort of thing. I just make sure that. 
we're not gonna sort of aggravate loads of zombies. Oops, I didn't do that corner. Whoops. Or should I say the centre? It's still a corner. There we go. Okay. So I will drop all these. I'll probably end up walking into them anyway, but luckily enough they do sort of jump one spot. great then I mean we should be safe enough should be safe enough for the night should be she says here's hoping I'm only doing it three at the moment just so I can get around all four sides hopefully This is what brought you back to see, just to see that I am starting. This is going to be the base from start to finish of the, of the playthrough. I'm, I have been known to change my mind, so... We may go to another area and I think, oh, I like this area better. And then I'll end up building something there as well. I mean, we can build some little outposts, that's no problem. So, just so we can get to these places. I don't know how far out we are from each of the areas. But I do like to build on forest and desert. Because you've got the two biomes there that you know you do need resources from. So forest has, I think, everything. Uh, bar shale. And obviously the desert has shale. So... We're going to need the shell because we're going to need the fuel. That's why I want to build this way. Go. That's better. There we go. Right. We have managed to do it all the way around there. Hopefully, we won't need many more. Right, okay, I do want to have a way to go up. So I think we'll take this one out for now. Just in case we do get attacked through the night, then I can get up onto the roof and try to stay alive basically there we go I am going to put the bedroll on top I think I think I'm not going to put ladders up, I'm just going to put blocks up to get onto the top. There we go, level 3 as well. Yeah, I did level 1. And I have killed quite a few zombies because I was clearing the area. I say quite a few, not that many. Not that many. Um, 10. Because they were irritating me while I was trying to build. Okay, so here's the start off. This is just going to be my home away from home for the night. Don't have much in the way of lighting, so that's going to be a thing. So let's go grab the bedroll. So the bedroll's going to go on the top, so just in case I do end up dying. Um, I've got all this to take with me. 
so should we take that now no I don't have anywhere to put it okay so there's the there's the base it's not too far away from the road which I don't want so that I uh, upgrade these and draw. make sure I get my spawn point done I'll probably put a box up here as well to be honest just in case they do get in through the night or while I'm still building everything and that way I don't have to keep taking everything off of the floor while I'm digging I could just move it all the way down when I'm done. Okay. Nearly done. I just wanted to make sure that the first day was spent getting sort of to the area, having a quick look around, trying to get a pot, and yeah. There we go. Gonna have problems because I don't have any water. So that's the thing. Darn it. I've got one water and that's it. So we're going to have to do uh, some runs actually. I know it goes down a lot there but we can build sort of, uh, in that area there when I do the other bits that I want to do. I can level it all off. Absolutely fine. Do want to grab my things though? There we go. That's just so I don't end up having to go really, really slow. Okay, I'm just going to move everything into here now, just so I'm set for the night. Okay, a decent amount of meat, so at least there's that. And we'll put those in. And we'll go for the rest of the stuff. I will put a door on. The door's not going to stay there, though. But that's fine. I can always knock the door back out again. If not, they put up them. I think that's everything. Yeah. Oh, I'll leave that there until the morning. I know I can't sprint now, but at least I've got everything now. Got everything. So... You know, you can sort of first day, make sure that you get a little something built and then just build through the night or that type of thing. So it can be done. You just have to really remain focused. But I do normally get so distracted and be like, right, okay, I'm going to go quest and everything else. And that's no good because, you know, by the time you're done with all that, it's uh, night time. We do have some honey, just in case we end up infected over the next couple of days. I think we should be fine. We should be absolutely fine. Right. Okay, that's uh, that's me, my little area. I'm not going to stay up here, obviously. Uh, let's just do a door. Secure a door. zombies want to come along and bash it off that's fine there we go nice and we might as well upgrade it there we go awesome okay 
<laughs> Not brilliant, but you know, it'll do. It's a start. It's a start. There we go. So I'm going to be in here uh, through the night, and if uh, if I do need to get up out of the way, I'll just come up here. At least this way as well, I can sort of jump down and, and run if necessary. So there is that. Right, guys. Well, thank you very much for watching, and uh, hopefully, I will see you in the next episode. Uh, thank you very much once again for all your support and uh, staying subscribed and waiting for me to come back. I really do appreciate it. And uh, yeah, it's nice to be back. It's fantastic. It's great. Love it. <laughs> right, guys. See you next time. Bye for now.